mold leaks and balconies that have crashed to the ground. Homeowners in the Willowbrook neighborhood near Lakewood Ranch say their homes are just falling apart and they are worthless. They blame the builder KB Home. We've been telling you about this problem for weeks now. But tonight, as 8 on your side's Shannon Benkin shows us, there's some new information to suggest the builder knew about the major structural defects but rushed to sell the homes before the residents found out. After numerous repairs, Kelly Hayes's balcony looks like this. She puts towels around her window to soak up rainwater and keep her baby from touching the moldy drywall. I have a dismantled balcony with water intrusion, and I have a gushing window full of water when it rains. About 60 homeowners in the Willowbrook neighborhood complain of leaks, mold, and collapsing balconies. They blame their builder, KB Home, and say they've received only patchwork repairs. KB insists it will fix the problems, but residents don't trust them. And I say no. You need to buy back my home and I'm done with this. Now they have a new reason to question KB's honesty. A federal whistleblower lawsuit filed in 2007 alleges KB executives knew about but concealed life-threatening structural defects. The suit filed by a former human resources director says he was fired when he refused to play along. The suit, which was settled quickly, says an engineering report showed KB used substandard inadequate adequate materials in the construction of the rear load-bearing wall of 50 to 60 townhomes. The whistleblower Reuben O'Neill says sales agents were told to proceed with closing on homes anyway. Aid on Your Side has tried for weeks to get answers for Willowbrook. Regional President George Glantz finally agreed to talk. We corrected in each unit under the supervision of an engineer and we notified the homeowner and that was it. But the letter sent to homeowners is dated August 2007, months after the whistleblower says the defects were discovered. Do you see how some of these homeowners, when they read these allegations in this lawsuit and think that they were duped when they bought their homes, how they might have trouble trusting you now? What we're focused on is taking care of our customer and standing behind our warranty. If they are concerned about a particular condition in their home, we're happy to take a look at that. KB says they changed building plans after these defects were found and used different material in the rest of the condos. But many of the homeowners I spoke with bought their homes years later and have the same problems. So it sounds like, though, uh, it, listening to that interview, that he, he and KB is ready to, to make the repairs necessary. But you have to wonder from the homeowner's perspective, even if they come in and do everything they possibly can, do the homeowners feel like they've been made whole in the process? Well, the homeowners I talk to say they're really worried about how they're going to resell their homes. There's this stigma out there. This news is everywhere. It's on the Internet. People know about it. So even if they are able to come in and fix their houses, and they doubt that they will, but if they are able to and it never leaks again, will people buy these houses? All right. More to this story to come. Thanks, Shannon.